I will be forever the myth. You're the king of kings, <laughs> There's always a pecking order. The little peckers never mess with the big peckers. So I'm a rooster, and he's a chicken for the week. And three-time champion bodybuilder, Mr. Olympia, will do some poses for us here on the show. Where is he? Is he up there? There he is. Look at this guy. There he is, right there. He is a police officer from Dallas, Texas. And I thought you'd like to meet him. Uh, please welcome from Dallas, Texas, Ronnie Coleman. Thank you. Now, third, third year in a row. Three times straight. Wow, that's now Arnold Schwarzenegger held the old, held the, the old record. He's what, seven in a row? He held seven in a row, and Lee Haney beat him. But well, speaking of Arnold, I'm getting ready to do his show. Oh, okay. Yeah, he wanted me to throw that in right quick. <laughs> <laughs> now, the, the first time you won it, was it just unbelievable? Uh, yeah, I think they got a clip of it. It was very overwhelming. Let's take very a look. Here he is. Here is first time he won. Oh, they did he bring a clip. Of it. Second place. Flex Wheeler! <laughs> oh, oh. Bring back the memory. So how did this start? Were you like a, were you the 98 pound weakling? Did you... Well, did actually it? I was a 98 pound weakling when I was about five years old. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, I've come a long way since then, though. Now, how did you get started? Because you're a police officer, and you still are a police officer. 12, yeah, I've been on the police force for 12 years now, and, uh, you know, I started working out when I was about 12 years old. Yeah. Because I was, people just asked me if I worked out, and I told them no, so I thought what would happen if I did, so I started working out, and, and got kind of big, and from there, uh, I think I joined the police force in 1989. Right. Uh, a friend of mine saw me one day after I finished my training and took me to this gym because I was working at the station at the time. And the guy who owns the gym, Brian Dawson, said, uh, to told me I, I could be world champion if I competed. I told him, no, no, no. I just joined on the police department. I don't want to take any steroids. And I love hamburgers. I love pizza. God bless you. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite food, and I don't want to compete. Thank you. But he told me that uh, he'd give me a free membership to the gym <laughs> if I competed. Yeah. So you know how we are about free. Oh, yeah, free, free. <laughs> You're so, a cop, donuts, free, yeah, free. Yeah. Uh, I said, okay, and uh, did my first show, Mr. Texas won, yeah. and I've been winning. Well, since. how much do you work out every day? About 45 minutes an hour a day, well, believe that, it or not. I do 45 <laughs> minutes a day. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, don't, you don't have the same genetics. I have. I'm kind of like what they call a genetic freak. I've been called a genetic freak. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this chin. But... <laughs> But my, I, got, I got a whole body that's genetically yeah. freaky, so no, no, no. it's a little bit different. I didn't really? get the chin. <laughs> I mean, do you eat, like, what do you eat normally? Like, I was, Kevin and I were, I, Kevin and I argue about this. Believe, be, believe it or not, normally I eat hamburgers, right. pizza, right. Uh, fried you. chicken. Fried chicken. Oh, you're telling me, Roddy. <laughs> well, then you put it back in the fryer. I hope I will not get mad about that. <laughs> Potato chips? Potato chips, one of my favorite foods. Oh, yeah. You're Just killing stuff. me, Ronnie. You're no vegetables. Oh, no, I hate vegetables. Oh. <laughs> Matter of fact, how about oh. tofu? You know that tofu crap? What is that? Thank you very much. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Is that a food? <laughs> and what do you weigh? Right now, I'm probably about 305. 305? Yeah. 305. And chest size? No, I'm about 58. 58? Yeah. How about biceps? About, about 24. 24. <laughs> now let me ask you something. You're a police officer. Okay. You pull a guy over. This would scare the hell out of me. I see you guys. I mean, what do criminals yeah. do? They just fall down in the street and wet their matter pants? Fact, what do they uh, do? <laughs> <laughs> matter of fact, this one guy that pulled over was kind of kind of nervous. And, uh, you know, you pull somebody over, the first thing they do is jump out of the car. Yeah. So this guy jumps out of the car, and I jump out of the car, and he sees me. <laughs> and he falls down on the ground, <laughs> puts his arm out. I told him to get up, you know, and the first thing he said was, don't hit me. <laughs> and, you know, you know, we proceeded on, I gave him a ticket, he went on about his business, but I guess it's a pretty interesting thing. Let me ask you something, because there's a lot of myths about bodybuilders. Like, people say, oh, when you're that big, you can't touch your toes, or you can't do, 
you know, certain things that a person obviously not in that kind of shape. But is, is there any truth to some of those? Nah, things? No truth to no. that, none of that kind of stuff. I can do just about anything a normal person can do, believe it or not. Right, right, right. I'm and pretty how, flexible. How about where do you get your clothes? Well, to be honest with you, I shop at the, the Mr. Taylor Man shop. <laughs> <laughs> Did I you go to that, the big and tall I, thing? I tried that big and tall thing, but the thing about the big and tall is for a big, tall, and a fat guy. <laughs> <laughs> Because I didn't have a lot of fat, so... Now, what, I, is, your, what is your body fat? Like, I'm about 95% body yeah. fat. <laughs> the highest my body fat has ever been was like 5%. 5%. And what's the lowest? The lowest it's ever been was like 0.33. 0.33? That's contest shape. Wow. Five is five cents like off season when I'm not getting ready for a show when I'm eating the hamburgers yeah. and the pizza and right. all that kind of stuff. Now, how about a girlfriend? You got a girlfriend? No, I'm a single guy. They're all afraid of me. Why the, why the, too big. Too big. <laughs> they think I'm going to hurt them. You know, I'm I had the same guy. problem. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, show me some. Can we see some poses? Yeah, yeah. I need a couple of poses. Yeah, I want to see some poses. Okay, now. Oh, I got to take the pants off. Where's your doctor now, baby? <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah. I love something. Now, let me ask you something. Now, now obviously, there must be a lot of groupies. You must get a lot of groupies. Mm, I get a few. You get a few. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I try not to get too many, though. Kind of, they, kind of like takes away from yeah. workout and stuff. I need now, to what do it. women say when they see you, when they meet you for the first time? They go, like, Ooh. That's exactly... Well, they grab other places, too. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I, I hope it all works. Yeah. <laughs> it works out pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> now, I, I, I mentioned it. I asked Lennox, uh, Lennox Lewis this the other night, too. That now, do you abstain from sex before you're working out? Is that, or does it make no difference? be honest with you, it makes a lot of difference. <laughs> really? Yeah, I keep as far away from it as I possibly can. So no sex when you're training? Why? Uh, it makes it kind of hard to lift weights. It takes away from the strength. I don't know how to takes away from I don't the think strength? Lewis lift weights. No? Yeah. So if you have sex, you look... Like, the fighters, you say you go weak in the knees. Is that true? No, you weak all over. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> so not just the knees, the arms, legs, everything. So, but if I'm just like regular, you know, and I get ready for a show, then right. I get as much as I can. Really get as much as you can. <laughs> so you try to stock up before that. Yeah, 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 there you go. <laughs> yeah, I know well, that training. Well, good luck to you. Now you're going to compete again. You're going to go for four? I'm going for four. Uh, matter of fact, we're trying to get you to be our next host at the Miss Olympia. Well, I could do it. Matter of fact, I got a contract over there in my... Oh, yeah. And my, my parents didn't want me to get you to sign You know today. something? The way you look right now, I'd sign anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good thank you, man. Put the hurting on you today.